this one too. You on two? I'm on two. All right, get in there. I'm in there like swimwear. Okay, all right. All right. Oh, don't turn. See, turn that camera. Turn that camera. This camera. That, yeah, turn that camera on you, man. Bow, mug. I'm in the house. What's that? Because, because we're we're gonna talk uh, to my girl, Tommy Morgan. Tommy, you there? Yes, I am here. Yes, she is here. Can you hear her yet? Uh, uh, I got my boy. Um, Show enough in the building. I'm plugging in, girl. What's happening, baby? <laughs> Hello, show enough. Show enough. Hey, should we say that one more time? <laughs> <laughs> I hear you. Now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so every week, like I said, every week I have my girl Taomi uh, from Glam Erotica 101.com come on and uh, talk about her top post of the week. And, uh, have I met this one? Yes, you have. Oh, this is that big, tall, sexy, dark skinned model chick. Yes. <laughs> what a <laughs> <laughs> Yes, that would be me. I'm not dark skinned, I'm brown. <laughs> okay. Except the darkness. <laughs> I am chocolate, but I am dark. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Just, get, get it out, man. I know where you know. Just get, go ahead and get it out. Get it out. I I, I saw your, your your blog, and oh, I was okay. like, I was like, wow, you couldn't tell this from, wow. Yeah, yeah. I was like, you <laughs> when did you look all conservative and stuff when she came up here? Yes. The more I read read on this blog, the more I like her. <laughs> she has the beyond personality. <laughs> she knows what she wants and goes for, for it. it. All right, so this you week, had yeah, the, yeah. So this week, uh, <laughs> I just want to know what's your favorite sound? <laughs> sound. Hey, hey man. Hey, hey, T. I just want to know what was your number one post from this week? My number one post for the week was about how deep the vagina is. Mm. Okay. And, um, what What did you find? Uh, what did you find out? Where 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 does the basement end? What is the ground floor at? Well, um, from tests that were done on women, with 100 women that did not have children. Okay. And were of sexual, you know, sexually active, they found out that the average vagina, when a woman is not allowed, so just at a regular, you know, normal state, the vagina is about 2.75 three inches deep. 2.75? 2.75 okay. two, 2. inches deep? Yeah. So, so, exactly. so, so, it's like a, so it's like a kiddie pool? Yeah, a kiddie pool. Okay. You know, but that's, that's aver on average. And so when a woman is aroused, uh -huh. it lengthens to about 4.75 inches. It, wait, wait so how, how, how deep now? Uh, 4.75 inches. Okay. So a little on five inches. Okay. Okay. So 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 this <laughs> is this is interesting to me because all these women want these men with like this the foot long, but they <laughs> they, they can only hold about a quarter of that. So talk to me about that. How how's that work? I want to well, know how the hell it expands. <laughs> how do it expand? Well, see, when a woman gets aroused, the body does a lot of things in order to you know help a woman begin the process of you know, conception. So even though it only lengthens to 4.75 inches, the vagina has an elastic quality. That's okay. why you can, you can push a baby out of there. That's true. You know how That's big true. babies can be, That's up true. to 11 pounds, 15 yeah. pounds even. So even though it's only that, that long, you know, the vagina can, can shape itself to, to fit. To fit the penis. Now here's the thing. Yeah. So this, here's the thing, D. That's a glove. So, so if you, right, uh -huh. Don't have the uh, length, uh -huh. okay? Mm -hmm. Let's say you have a five-inch penis, okay? Now, mm -hmm. you get a girl who hadn't had sex in a while, you're going to seem quite nice to her, all right? Yeah. Here's the problem. If she cheats on you with a big dude, you should know the difference. Am I right here? If she yeah, cheats, you should, you should know because you're not hitting the walls um, anymore. I'm well, sorry. It, it depends because um, there are exercises that you can do. You know, kegels, you can do those to tighten the walls back. But like okay. I said, it's exactly. elastic. So it'll go back to its original shape. Okay. And then there's the poor woman's way. As uh, Mike Epps said, snap that me back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, there's ways for women to get this done. But I'm, I'm, I'm totally like, and I've heard that rumor that the actual uh, 
size of the vagina is actually smaller than the size of a man. Average the average penis. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, the yeah. average Johnson. Mm-hmm. So what I'm confused on the fact is why women aspire to put something such as their fist to their forearm up in that. <laughs> well, because it, it it expands, and they want to test the expenditure of their vagina. Oh, okay. not only that, but they they believe most of them believe that the bigger the better. But honestly, um, most of the nerve endings in the vagina are only within a few inches in, about I think one and a half to two inches in. Uh huh. So, so when he's beating the uh, balls up, when he's like when he's get down there in them guts, as they like to say, <laughs> it it is uh is really not. Th- th- is that what you, you're feeling it? But that's basically the the bottom of the shaft is what you're really feeling. Is that what you're trying to tell yeah, me? See, when you get that deep, uh-huh. what you're starting to hit now is the top of the cervix and even the uterus. Okay. And if you go too far, you know, sometimes women can experience pain, like abdominal pain, bleeding, mm-hmm. rupturing, even tearing. So mm-hmm. I, you know, I wouldn't suggest women try to go after ten inch dicks because I mean, don't be looking for them. So, yeah, when, when you get to a certain point, you're going to hurt yourself. So honestly. you're saying that's when the guy becomes a gynecologist. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And, and, starts, and starts exploring things that he's not oh, supposed to be exploring. So at that point, sex stopped being sex and it becomes a pap smear. Exactly. <laughs> I've given many <laughs> of those. <laughs> <laughs> So, I just want to know, in your area of expertise, are you speaking from personal references? Well, it's a lot of it with, with the research that I did for this. It was research, mm-hmm. um, but I mean, I know for you haven't uh, measured yours. Uh, you haven't. Oh, you, you, did you measure yours? Did you how do you measure ruler? that? She, stick a ruler in that joint. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's but, how, but how did it, honestly? You, I think on, on your blog you did mention how you measure. Uh, oh no! I didn't mention how you measure. I mentioned how you can uh, find out the curvature. Okay. Of it. Mm-hmm. So, and you know. I read a, um, a tweet from Dr. Rachel about that where you can just, you know, stick your finger up there and you can see if it curves up and back or up and down. Okay. You know, and that's how you can figure that out. But the average woman, um, it's straight where it curves up and back. Okay. Well, again, ah. uh, for everybody out there, this is uh, Tommy Morgan. She is the founder of GlamErotica101.com. And also, yeah. you can catch her on Twitter at uh, Glamazon Tayomi. You know, I struggle with that. I'm, I had to think about it at Glamazon Tayomi on Twitter. <laughs> and uh, please just go check out her site. It's actually very, I mean, because honestly, you're a beautiful girl, and that's and that helps. But the the blog is actually very dope, and I, I love what you've been doing, and you've been updating daily, and you've been doing a great job I, with I it. I really want you to correct that, that way you just described her. She's beautiful and raunchy naughty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Monty Naughty. <laughs> I read your blog. I read your blog. I read your blog. You're borderline <laughs> raunchy. <laughs> raunchy. You know what I'm saying? As naughty as you want to be, I swear, it's, 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 it's great naughtiness going on there. But then, certain, oh my God. like, seriously, there's certain things that I, I saw, man, I was like, dude, check it out. I was like, oh my God. That's raunch. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's borderline. Hey. We're all adults. You just got to keep it straight 100. No taster. Exactly. Yes, yes, that's why I'm telling you it's Ranji. (laughs) (laughs) Again, T, uh, until next week, girl, you be doing it, all right? All right, you too. All right, thank you, man. I'm going to follow you. Bye. (laughs) Yeah, follow me. Please do. I don't know if you want to follow him, uh, want him to follow you the way he thinks about following you. <laughs> we out. It's, it's, please, man. Yo, what I want to know, man, just real quick, man. Uh-huh. I'm looking at what you get your video posting, man, and it's only one small thing that I'm bothered by. What? As we're talking about the VJJ. That hole, that gaping hole that's in the in yeah, the video. I know what's in the video might be a vag- I mean. It, I don't think it's a vagina. We're talking about a VJJ. But I don't think that's a vagina. No, that's not a VJJ. That is a uh, Duke shoot. Oh, it is? Yes, that's, okay. that's the Dookie shoot. That's man. the Dookie shoot? Dookie shoot. shoot. Yeah, that yeah, definitely that's, is. That's when you're trying to put yourself in an itty situation. Right. That's, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> we out of here. <laughs>